What's good YouTube? This video will be different from all my other videos, man. You know what I'm saying? Like we just lost a very talented young man and it's it's crazy. I've been a fan of him for ever since he started, like as far as before he took off and then when he finally blew up I was so excited that he made it and what shocked me was he wasn't one of those artists that the lane I put him in he was like so much more than just that you know what I'm saying come to find out he's a very versatile artist and then what really made me start like him not just as an artist but more as a person is watching his watching him speak after his live performance and see how how positive of a person he was and how he always used his platform to try to motivate the youth and tell them that they could be better and it's just it's all everything like what I stand for as far as trying to push love and positivity man and it's just sad we lose somebody that's so talented and gifted and a great leader before they even get a chance to reach their peak and i truly feel like i truly feel like this man had the potential to make a big difference on a lot of young kids like man like he did a lot while the short time he had on this earth is sad i'm still in i'm still in shock like i don't really you don't really believe it but it's crazy how you realize how how blessed somebody was or how gifted or what type of impact people make after they gone you know what i'm saying it make you it make you cherish all the things that you didn't look at so deep you know what i'm saying Another thing too, what I really started admiring about X is just his positive spirit and then by just listening to him speak and watching him and a lot of times where he stream and go live on his own and he speak and it's just so much, it's just so much wisdom and a lot of people hated him hated on him for the mistakes he made but what they was failing to realize this man was young like he's he died at the age of 20 he he he's so young meaning he had so much life to live and there was so many mistakes he was going to make but when you young you know of course you're gonna make mistakes but one thing i really liked about him was the growth you know what i'm saying because he started out so rough edge and really just a wild loose cannon but in a short amount of time he he was turning into something that was so much greater than what he started out and I always seen the growth in him last thing I want to say man is as a fan of yours we love you I know a lot of people love you, and you will be missed, man. In the short amount of time you was on this earth, you made a great impact, and you inspired so many. Rest in peace, homie. Um, for the words of inspiration, I just really wanted to tell you guys that it does not matter what your dream is or what your goal is. You make sure that it is your prime priority to follow what you believe is good for you. Do not live your life trying to impress someone else and do not live your life trying to be someone you're not and do not live your life making yourself miserable just to amount to someone else's idealism. You don't want your life to be the structure of someone else's dream. You don't want to. You don't want your life to be. You don't want to be following someone that's taking you down a dark road. And.
And I really want to tell you that I truly believe, I believe in the human race period and I truly believe that anyone can be what they want to be. We need people to ideally take care of the world. We need good mothers, we need good fathers, we need people with sources of knowledge. Let's make it not cool to be stupid. Let's make it cool to be a good person. I'm tired of it being cool to be a fucking murderer or a shooter or just this this irrelevant being like that shit is stupid worst thing comes to worst i fucking die a tragic death or some shit and i'm not able to see out my dreams i at least want to know that the kids perceived my message and were able to make something of themselves and able to take my message and use it and turn it into something positive and to to at least have a good life i at least if i'm gonna if i'm gonna die or ever be a sacrifice I want to make sure that my life made at least 5 million kids happy. That's all I wanted to say. I love you guys. Have a good one.